love going to Galway, and I mean, you know, I don't see that about everywhere, but Galway, um, weirdly, I like the gigs, I like the people, but but Galway, it's, what's great, one of the things that's great about Galway for me is I've done a lot of good work there. When a, you can get in the hotel there, and um, I normally try and stay on an extra day, and you can look out across to the borough, you know, and it's a really brilliant atmosphere, and I can, I can get, I, I remember the second series of, um, comedy vehicle for BBC Two. I basically fixed it in a hotel room in, in Galway over two days. I had all the bits in notes and I sat there from eight in the morning till nine o'clock every night for two days after I'd done my gig, worked the whole series out. And then every night I'd go out and have four pints of Guinness, some Jameson's and watch loads of great folk music. And I'm sure that's a terrible cliche, but the reward at the end of the day the whole, so I basically, I got months of work done in two days in Galway. To me, it feels like uh, it's like it's very, it's got a very great fe feeling for me because I love the shows and the people. But also, I think oh, when I get to Galway, I can sit in that hotel and I can sort this bloody thing out. You know, it's sort of become a place where I've got good associations of doing good work. You know, plus when you do Kevin's Little Club. You get to sleep in a bed in the flat that the Fall have slept in and John Martin slept in and the New York Dolls have slept in and you, you feel it's much better than uh, just sitting in a seat that a load of comedians have sat in. You get to sleep in a rock bed, so it's really cool.